Okay, it's recording. Yeah, hi. Uh, we're down at Timeless Archery Finishing, Grand Rapids, Michigan, 616-453-8309. You can find us on the World Wide Web at www.timelessrgr.com. That's in Grand Rapids, Michigan, of course. Today, uh, we're going to be working out of an old rocking chair. Um, I think it's called Singer. It's S-E-N-G-R. It's made out of Chicago. I'd have to date this back to the 1800s. It's a nice old rocker. It's solid maple and it was finished in a cherry color back in the day, back in the 1800s. Um, this chair came to me out of, I want to say Grant, Michigan. Um, the guy collects old furniture, has a passion for antiques and so on. He found his chair and he'd like to have it restored. So he found us. And uh, so like I said, this is a, it's a nice old rocker here. It's really well constructed. It was quite a job getting it to where it's at right now. <clears throat> There's an awful lot of little turnings going on in here. We do all this, we hand strip all this stuff, sand it off. Um, then this has already been sealed up and sanded, and what I'm gonna and I've actually glazed it. And what I'm actually gonna do right now is I'm gonna show you how I gun shade it. I'm gonna put a coat of top coat on it, and I'm gonna gun shade it the color. Um, and it's gonna appear like it's completed, but it really won't be because uh, I have to let it set. I'll put a couple more coats on it tomorrow. I'll flip it over again and. Uh, Try to put a little bit of finish up on the bottom side of this chair, um, just so it's the timeless art quality when it leaves my shop. So after I flip it around tomorrow, put a little finish up under here, I'll let the chair dry. And the chair has been finished on the bottom side already, but I just glaze it, I'm going to shade it. And so tomorrow I'll do a little bit of that to where I couldn't reach. I'll re-sand the whole chair and give a couple more coat, uh, top coats of finish and she'll be done and uh, then we'll be ready to go to the poster. So uh, enjoy the show here. I'm gonna, first I'm gonna hit it with a little coat of lacquer. It's a pre-catalyzed lacquer. I get it at uh, Valspar um, at Repco Light. And uh, after that I'm gonna gun shade it with a little bit of a cherry color. So. <clears throat>
wet coat. This is the color I'm going to be putting on it. See how that shader's on? Got a little brownie, a little tin of red to that. I mix them colors up myself down here. <laughs>
Thank you. 